Okay, so, excuse me if I look a little crazy. I have an, uh, just derma rolled my lips, actually. Um, I'm trying to keep from derma rolling my entire face, except for every 30 days, but um, our skin on our lips tends to overturn and heal a lot quicker, so um, I noticed that I'm losing collagen more on one side than the other, so I'm trying to keep it a little bit more, and I got some new uh, collagen cream. Um, if anything looks shiny here, that's why, um, because it kind of went, as you can see, over. Um, so I'm trying to build up my collagen more back into my lips. Um, I have nice lips to begin with, but I was noticing in some of my videos, in my upper lip, one side looks a little thinner than the other. Not that everybody's gonna notice, but it's something that I'm picky about, so. And I'm not gonna go get, um, anything for it. So, I got my first Ipsy bag today. Now, I'm... They had me as being signed up before, and I wasn't. I'm guessing that I signed up at one point and was on the waiting list, and then just removed myself. Um, I've done uh, Boxy Charm for a while, which is a box of four to five full-sized beauty products a month. Um, and it was $20 or $21, something like that, with free shipping. So... Ipsy is $10 a month, free shipping, and you get mostly um, sample size products, but you can go on the site and review them and earn points and then exchange your points in for full size products, which I like that idea. Now, okay, when they offered me a reward to re-sign up, so I said, okay. I can't remember what the other reward was, but this was one of them, and it's from It Cosmetics. I love It Cosmetics. This is my sculpted face. It is a um, just a palette for highlighting and contouring. It has um, kind of a charting on the back, and I would imagine inside there's more. Um, so. I don't know if we're going to take a closer look at that now or if we'll do that a little bit later. So, this is the one thing that I do like about Ipsy is you get a bag every month. And I always have a ton of cosmetics and I have like four or five good sized bags. And I really just need to go ahead and invest in like the three, four hundred dollar makeup willy thing from Amazon. But I can't afford it for now. So, for right now, I need these little makeup bags for different things um, so I can throw what I need in one and take with me or throw you know give my daughter one of my other bags or this bag or another future Ipsy bag for her makeup she doesn't really wear much or for her medication um, I don't think my son's gonna want an Ipsy bag for his medication I could be wrong and I won't tell him no if not but this one's cute I mean for what it is so and now they have, well, I don't know if they ever did, but if they did this before or not, but you have an option to view what it, like, preview what all's coming in your bag. So, yes, I knew what was coming beforehand, and I knew that there could be different colors uh, on some of the things. So, the colors were a surprise. And I got the color that I wanted in one of the products, but in the other product, I didn't get the color I wanted. And you'll see what I mean. But this is a, a scone, insanely tattooed, waterproof eyeliner, eyeliner in jet black. And I'm just going to assume that this is likely a full size. I don't know. It could be a trial size. I don't know. I'll be I'll be trying these out at some point because I'm definitely going to review them for the points on the side. Okay, now this is the one that I didn't get the color that I wanted. And I am assuming that this is probably a full-size product. It is a metallic shimmer color. I can't really get it to pick up on here. Um, this one's more like a golden brownish color. Um, it's called Cheers to Life Eyeshadow. And it's by City Color Shadow. They're cruelty free. Mr. Romax is broken on teacher appreciation. So yeah, um, I would assume this is a full size. I could be wrong. The other color that was available was the shimmer green, and I really wanted it. But, because I don't really wear a lot of naturals or nudes, I will sometimes just because. Um, but I'll definitely try that out for sure. 
and let you guys know. So then I got something from NYX Cosmetics. I love NYX. And what this is, it's called whipped, and I don't know how to say that other word, but this is just a liquid. It's got a little Dofa applicator. I do know that. I've not opened this one yet, but I will look at the product on the Breedy. Um, you, there was like three products, I think, that they came with, and um, there was this one, another one, there was a, a nude one, and this is for, this is a lip color and a liquid cheek color. Now, whenever you sign up for Ipsy, they kind of do a um, profile on you where you can pick like what colors you would like, what cosmetics you like, if you want to be sent samples for perfumes and stuff like that. So you kind of have a say so on what you get and don't get. And then as you review products on the side, it gives them more of an idea to curate your next bag. So we'll see. Now this I'm a little disappointed in because this is a blush sample. Yeah. It's from Balm Springs. It says long wearing blush for hot days and warm nights. The Balm Cosmetics is what it's called. But yeah, this is a sample and it's like a magnetic box. But yeah, that, I don't know. I don't know why they make a blush sample this small. Like, I just, I don't know. And I've seen that that was a huge problem when I was looking at the reviews of some of these products. That this was reviewed as just like being so small that people were just like, I can't do anything with it. Um, I mean, you can see that's the size of the pan. So, I mean, tearing it out of the box isn't going to do any good either. Uh, if I use a blush brush that... I don't know. I'll try to figure it out, but um, that's really not a shade I would use, but um, I don't know. Once I get it on, it may be a little different story, so who knows? I think that's it for that. Okay, so I got two sheet masks, and I was, I, I have already looked through these, so, um, and I was talking to my husband about them. So this one is the Aloe Rescue, and they're sheet masks. Um, Listen, kids, dudes, I don't want you to think and you then the green tea detox sheet mask. And um, I I've looked at the ingredients on the back. They are identical except for the aloe one has aloe and the green tea doesn't. They are identical. <laughs> One thing I do like is they don't have alcohol, but it has perfume listed, which could really be about anything, so it could have. Um, but I will definitely try these out at some point. I may try them out on here with you guys and let you guys know what I think about them. Um, the green tea says purifying fiber mask with vitamin E for all skin types. It does not have parabens and it is cruelty free. The Aloe Rescue says revitalizing fiber sheet mask with vitamin E for all skin types. Um, same thing, no parabens, cruelty free. And this one is for after sun use. Up here, or up here, it has a little thing. And then this one too. Now, they send you these little cards, and this one talks about their app. Now, I downloaded their app and looked it over yesterday. Um, you can actually take a sneak peek at your bag and the stuff that could come in it and the colors that you can get. You, you know, I think the colors are kind of chosen fit to your profile. And because they ask like your eye color and your skin tone and then like they give you a group of colors to choose from. But um, you can look up specials or deals that last for some time. It's usually stuff that's in the bag so from the company. So anyway, check that out, and I will let you guys go.